Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Hangtown with Tommy. Today we're going to be checking out Disneyland and more specifically we're going to be checking out Main Street USA as well as the Star Wars Galaxy's Edge Cantina and maybe some treats towards the end. So what a better way to start the video with some Mary Poppins. So let's go for a spin. Hey Peter. <laughs> I only got one hand, but <laughs> oh, hey. Oh, oh. See you. Good day. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Peter. Have a good day. That was Peter Two, and if you don't know who he is, go ahead and Google him. Peter Two Disneyland. You're welcome. All right, back to business, and we are checking out a map of Disneyland, which is pretty cool. But I'm actually in here to check out the 50th anniversary of the Haunted Mansion. This isn't normally here, and it's no longer there, but it was back in 2020, Super Bowl Sunday weekend. And I believe it was there for a while, but no longer there. But what was there was pretty cool and pretty awesome, especially if you're a fan of the Haunted Mansion, like most people are. Now, I can't remember what this stuff was exactly. Um, I believe it was concept art. I could be wrong. Now, there's a little shop just outside of that, which is just outside of Great Moments with Mr. Lincoln. There's a bunch of stuff that you can check out here and you can buy, which a lot of this stuff is very impressive, but a little pricey. But if you really want it, you can get it. Now, this right here, I regret I should have bought this shirt. I don't know if it's still around. Let me know in the comments below if you know if it's still around. But I really want this shirt, and I don't think it's around anymore. Now, in classic Hang 10 Tommy fashion, I do got to get a snack. And, of course, it's going to be a Disneyland corn dog because who doesn't love these? I mean, look at this thing. It is amazing. But you can't eat too much of it. And after that snack, I head straight to Main Street Magic Shop. And if you've never been in here, you need to go in here and check this out, especially if you're a fan of magic. Now, there is one thing I don't like in the shop, and it's that creepy doll. Yeah, not a fan of it. Now, right on Main Street, there is a pen trading store. And if you're into pen trading, then this is definitely a place you want to stop and check out. I've tried to do pen trading. It didn't really work out. I did get some really cool pens, but in the end, I found it's a little too expensive for me. However, I will grab a cool pen if I see it and I really want it. Now, another hidden gem and overlooked little thing on Main Street is the Main Street Cinema. Not many people know this is here, and they don't really stop by. It's actually a cool place to go in and check out, especially on a hot day if you want to cool down. Right on the inside, you have the actual cinema, which is multiple screens playing old-school Disney cartoons. Who can really argue with that? Especially when it's nice and cool on a hot day. You can just sit back, relax, and watch one of these cartoons for a little while. Not a bad idea. Speaking of hidden gems on Main Street, Crystal Arts. You can walk by this and miss it quite easily. Uh, if you've never been here, you need to come in here and check it out. Especially if you're a fan of things that are pretty. Because who isn't? Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think any of this is for sale. But if it is, nothing has a price tag, and that's always a red flag. 
But hey, if you really like it and you can afford it, I'm not knocking it. Now, what kind of vlogger would I be if I didn't get any video of the biggest show of the main street, in my opinion? The Disneyland Railroad. Round of applause, everybody. The one and only Disneyland Railroad. Doot doot! Now we have the Heroes of Main Street, which is the Disneyland Fire Department. They're a little outdated. I think they need an update. Or an upgrade. But hey, you know, they got style. I'll give them points for style. All right, at this point in time, I was headed to the cantina, but I ran into this little guy and, of course, had to get some footage of him. Okay, right here, I got the Yub Nub, which is Malibu Rum and Sailor Jerry. It came to $42, but you get to keep the mug, which is pretty cool. I still have it to this day. Now, this cantina is something crazy. Uh, if you've never done it, you have to do it at least once to try it and check it out. Uh, you actually forget you're in Disneyland you think you're in another galaxy. But that does it for my quick stop to the cantina. Now, to end the video with a nice little treat. Now, if you guys haven't learned by now, I have a sweet tooth that's a little bit out of control. But just not for any sweets. Special type of sweets. With a little bit of creativity. And that's kind of the reason why I like Disneyland so much. Is because they have all these treats and they're constantly changing. They're constantly thinking of new ideas constantly making new stuff it is one of the main things that makes disneyland so special and fun at least for me and my sweet tooth now i had to limit myself to one treat so i picked this it's basically peanut butter chocolate and sprinkles and a rice krispie treat and it was delicious all right guys that does it for this video but if you like what you saw give it a like if you want to see more give a subscribe and it helps the channel grow see you guys next time